So this was interesting. Um, I can, when I'm off, so, so, uh, I said this and then someone realized I was talking to was like, oh my gosh, that's the exact same thing that happens to me. One of the first signs that I am getting mentally off that I catch is that I think in like third person. Um, it's kind of like I hear a voice kind of talking me through things in my head and it's like, okay, Rachel, you'll be okay. Okay. Today we're going to do this, this, and this. You just got to take it nice and calm. And it says my name over and over, Rachel, Rachel, Rachel. And, and, and it's kind of my thoughts, but it's also not. It's something that, like, right now I'm not thinking, Rachel, talk to the video camera. I mean, it's something that when I get off, and it's almost like a, um, it calms me. The way it kind of talks to me, it's like, okay, now, and when it just breaks down everything. Uh, but, so, there's always, like, a lot of stuff going on in my head. And I was outside with my dog, and for some reason, I don't know why, I, I was just thinking, like, you know, about what maybe normal people think about. And I was like, I wonder if normal people, like, have those thoughts in their head of like someone else thinking and I was like that would that would make me so lonely and then I like suddenly got really scared that you know oh my gosh one day maybe I'm the only one in my head talking and I was just like I would be the most loneliest thing ever it's just like I'm just like <laughs> you know and I was mentally again I was off through all of this and I just started getting really really scared that the the, the talking the thought the third person talking would go away and I was like oh my god I don't want to be alone in my head my head's like really scary sometimes it was just bizarre and as I'm okay right now and sane completely I I, it's like it's hard for me to even wrap my my mind around what I got so terrified of of being alone in my head. But that's what I was. I was scared of being alone in my head. It's just an interesting thought. So right now, I guess I feel alone in my head. Like I'm the only one in control. But when I get off, there's usually like at least three. I don't know. It's weird, right? So if and my other people out there with the mental disorders have that kind of thing or have ever thought that, like have ever actually thought, oh my gosh, I don't want to be alone in my head. Like that's a scary thought. Anyway, just wondering. That was interesting. All right.